So in order to download DaVinci Resolve 17 for free, you need to go to blackmagicdesign.com slash products slash DaVinci Resolve slash hashtag. And that should take you to this page. If you don't see this exact section with the download link, try scrolling down a little bit from the top of the page. Also, I'll put the URL in the description of this video just to make sure you get specifically here. And then you'll need to click on the download button. Currently, Resolve 17 is in its beta version. So this is the free version over here. And then the DaVinci Resolve Studio is the full version of Resolve, which includes some extra features aimed more at professional video editors. So be sure to select the version that corresponds with your operating system. I'm running Windows right now, so I select the Windows version. Then you'll need to register some basic information. Go ahead and hit register and download at the bottom. You'll get this little pop up and then you should get the file save window. So I'm going to save the zip file of Resolve 17 onto the desktop currently beta six. And as you can see down here, it's a pretty big file, so it's going to take a little while to download. OK, so now we have the zip file totally downloaded to the desktop. So now you need to use a program like WinRAR or I prefer 7-zip in order to open it up and extract the installer. So you want this little executable file in here, the .exe. So drag that to the desktop here, left click and drag the file and it should start extracting. OK, now we can double click on the installer and run it. So now with the installer popped up, you may see a few options here. More than likely, you do not need the post gray SQL database unless you plan to save your projects to a database on that system. You probably do not need it. So go ahead and check the DaVinci Resolve 17 and then go ahead and hit install. When it's done, though, you should see DaVinci Resolve and possibly a few other related icons on the desktop. But if you just want to open DaVinci Resolve to do video editing, then this is the one you're looking for. And you know it is the new version because it has this new kind of squared off icon as opposed to the original circle. So at this point, you can just go ahead, open up the video editor and start working with it. So go ahead and check out my channel if you need some tutorials on how to use DaVinci Resolve 17. But that's going to be it for this video on how to install it. So I've been Chris, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in my future video content.